using a piece of plexiglass, we bent it with heat in a form, and then we used a vacuum pump to use a, an epoxy to veneer the plexiglass on a curve. And then we put brackets and LED light behind it, and we made this little light. It's an interesting little workbench area in my basement. It was more of an experiment than anything, but as you see, the, the burl veneer shows up great with a light behind it. Looks like fire. We did uh, six coats of polyurethane and polished it to a gloss finish, and um, it's on a timer if you want, and uh, it was an interesting project. Use of veneer, vacuum, bending, worked well. Doing a little varnishing today. I made this interesting light with some veneer and a curved piece of plexiglass. So we're pouring a little varnish into our con secondary container. We use the Bloxygen two second spray and a quart to keep the varnish from skinning over. I add a little Japan dryer. This varnish is very old and uh, this helps speed the drying just a little bit. You just gotta use a couple drops. Again, Bloxygen prevents any damage from oxygen during storage. Protect the Japan dryer. Then we mix it up. I added a little paint thinner and now we're putting it on the uh, project. And uh, this is been epoxied to the curved veneer using a vacuum pump and uh, now we're just putting four or five coats of varnish and that's what it'll look like approximately. Thanks.